And that's why productivity is nothing but human negotiation. Never. We are not looking for bronze, we are only looking for perfections. All the time. find out what does it taste. Uh, it's a mental reference for vodka language in your brain with today five different nosing jars that you have in front of you. But the vodka language, we developed that on the solvents and things like that. But when Raguz came, they changed that map a little bit because it was fruity and floral. Uh, so then we had to develop the language and that goes on year by year, as soon as a new vodka comes up, or with vodka with a new kind of character that we haven't seen before. However, what you see here uh, are the most... Downstairs is cold food, warm food, meatballs, fish, herring, whatever. So you find food living anywhere in the building. Just walk around and eat and enjoy the evening and have a good Okay?
16 minutes. <laughs> 16 minutes. There is a truck arriving here to pick up 16 pallets to go to the Techniques how you mix drinks. Uh, the first one is oh, yeah, broken glass. Sorry, broken glass. <laughs> broken glass. Yeah. Perfect. Then on the bottom. Yeah. How many of you mix drinks at home? Mm, sometimes. All of us. Sometimes. Yeah. What kind of mi uh, drinks do you prefer doing? Um, I'm a huge gin fan. Mm -hmm. So lemon bark. Yeah, you use a lot of ice. Anybody knows why we use a lot of ice? Or well, yes. Okay as well. Maybe to keep it cool? <laughs> yeah, and if you have a lot of ice, it keeps the rest of the ice cold, right? So it doesn't get water in. So if you have a good drink, you need a lot of ice, so it keeps cool for a longer period of time. You don't water it out, because you want the drink to taste good in the way. using a mixer, we just mix it with spirit, for example, as a vodka martini. Then you have to control the, control the ice and the water that comes from the ice. Then you stir it. By stirring. The most famous drink from TV shows. Any ideas? We have absolutely. Absolute. Yeah, of course. Otherwise, we don't discuss anything else. Just absolute. <laughs> Based on absolute citron. Quite easy drink to do at home.
and then some uh, freshly squeezed lemon juice, lime juice. And cranberry. So now, since I added a mixer, I have to shake it together. If I stir it, it won't com combine in the same way. But I still want to cool it down quickly, and I don't want it to water up. So a lot of ice. And then shake. Anybody know how to use this? No? Technique! Yeah. <laughs> Technique is to keep the glass bottom facing yourself. So in case of an emergency or accident, actually. <laughs> yeah, you know, you get everything on yourself, you spill. Instead of on your guests or whatever. It's easier for you to go and change your clothes and maybe you'll get it. And then just take. Now, for example, if you're having a dinner party or something, you want to make it a little more exclusive uh, to get the right touch, you just simply add lemon peel and from the outside, you squeeze the juice on top. So, uh, yeah. so the oil comes off the flavor top. Then you get more flavor, you know, feel the orange more. Yeah, we can do that as well. Uh, we can Start by come up and try this with a straw. Take like a straw like this. Just take it first, and then we'll, I can show you. Welcome. Don't be shy. Like that. So if you want to come up and try again, you'll feel uh, much more enhanced orange flavor. Feel it? It's quite a big difference, right? Next one, don't be shy. Have a shake. Mat. Sabine. Oh my god. Thank you.
So really, really, I need to say thank you before I hand over the microphone to someone else. So thank you from our heart. <laughs> First of all, I think I go to uh, the, actually the, the owner of this place. So I would like to introduce um, both of you, probably. Should I? No. <laughs> They're real confident. Alexandra is the owner of the place. So I think we should give a big applause for Alexandra. <laughs> It's very, uh, you don't haven't prepared anything, so <laughs> no pressure at all. I just want to welcome you all to Ozone, and uh, so much fun to see you all here, and I hope this will be a great evening. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. It's a pleasure to introduce you uh, Chris Jasbun, the VP for uh, Operation that just arrived from uh, Stockholm. So, uh, please welcome to the stage. <laughs> I wonder, what have you done today? How much drinks have you served today to get all those applause? I wonder. I wonder. Anyway, very welcome to Sweden, to Aarhus to our one source, the place where the sun always shines. <laughs> and this, honestly, this year is almost true. It has been a fantastic summer. Anyway, it's fantastic to have you here for the second collector's meeting. And I've been told that this year you've seen the real thing. And I hope you enjoyed it. I, I couldn't join you last year, uh, but I know that you were in Stockholm and saw uh, our headquarters where I was a few hours ago, and uh, you saw Atelier, and you saw uh, Speed Museum, but now you've seen the real thing, the birthplace of absolute Aarhus. Uh, Aarhus is special to me. I came to Aarhus uh, 32 years ago as a young, at that time, young production manager, and I told my wife that I would stay for three years. That's what you do when you, you're young and looking at your career. After three years, I said, uh, I still feel a lot of passion for this brand, so I can stay on a bit more. And here I am. <laughs> and you can imagine, it's fantastic for me to have so many people here to share that passion with. It's amazing. Uh, I couldn't really believe it when Elin said they're coming from all over the world to see your place in August. So it's fantastic. Very, very welcome to, to this part of the world. Uh, last year's meeting uh, was organized, I understood, by a guy that couldn't make it this year, Jesper Kreisbol. I understood that he's a famous guy within collector's circuits. Uh, we're very grateful for him, for what he did last year. But I would like to concentrate on the guy that uh, made it possible and planned it together with our team this year. So welcome up, Leon Ta Lai. <laughs> for what he has done. We have a small gift and I put it over here somewhere <laughs> and uh, you should open it. Please open it yourself. I can hold it. You just pull it and show it to the people. seen that medallion in my life. It's very special. 
<laughs> exactly. It's a personal, personalized bottle with uh, the medallion of, of Leon. And now you have already figured out why you asked you to, for a photo. <laughs> yes, you will all get your personalized bottle after dinner. <laughs> Said, you are extremely important to us. Absolute is all about passion. I could.